Hey guys, this is Tarot Things. If you don't know, now you know. Welcome back to the channel. I'm about to do a reading for my Scorpios um, or any cross watchers. Whoever this message resonates with, it's for you. Let's jump right into it. Spirit guys, what do you have for these Scorpios? Whoa, that's a lot of cards. Spirit guys, what do you have for my Scorpios? masculine energy it's giving you're getting a new job it's giving your financial status is just gonna bone up okay you're about to be um dealing with the big dogs and their tax brackets people you've idolized like it's 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 coming through for the kid it's definitely coming through for us yes i'm tapped into scorpio energy no i'm not a scorpio dog so it's coming through for us. And I said that I want to love it. Stop playing with me. Um, <clears throat> oh, King of Coins. Clarify King of Coins for me, Spirit Guys. Excuse my boyfriend in the motherfucking back. Oh, hype on his game. Alright, so we got the um strength card. Oh, oh, oh. Hold up, hold up. Hold up now. All right, King of Coins. We got King of Wands, Strength, the Four, and Swords. So, hmm. And for some of y'all, <clears throat> for some of y'all, okay, it, it was you. It was it was you starting at the bottom for us, and you were starting at the bottom. Okay, you start you built a whole foundation by yourself or you and yours your family your kids whatever all right you started from the bottom all right you went through so much to get there king of ones you went through so much like you've been through homelessness you've been through getting fired for no motherfucking reason like and not being your fault shut up please damn um love you though um and strength like you pulled through with the strength cord Okay, you uh, at the end of the day, you was always pulling out the strength card whenever you was going through. You pulled out the strength card, man. I was made, made for this, built for this. Da, da da. Okay, the full things started coming up for you. Like this is this is basically laying out the whole process. Things started coming up for you. Like shit started changing. Like you started getting callbacks for some jobs. All right, you started stacking your money from these jobs, and then you start your own business. Like on some entrepreneurship. I don't know what level you're at, like what card you're at, but this is the process that you're gonna go through. All right. Um, like I said, with the full card. You're going to get phone calls back, okay? You're going to start stacking your money, and you're going to turn that sh into your own sh okay? On some entrepreneur, sh on some entrepreneur level, okay? And Ace of Swords, that's when you come through, and you cut ties with all them broke motherfuckers, okay? You're cutting all the toxic people out your life. Like I said, you, you're in a new tax bracket. <laughs> Full circle, baby. And then you're in that, and now you're in this masculine energy, the emperor, now, baby, if that wasn't a read, I don't know what is. My daughter's right here <laughs> watching me. If that was a read, I don't know what is. She has her headphones on. She on her iPad. Um, and she looked back like, what you get out for? Um, all right. I want to pull. Hmm, I want to pull from this deck. Spirit got okay workaholic what i tell you what did i tell you <laughs> can i help you um workaholic you're not stopping <laughs> you you cannot stop you're not stopping and gossip is at the bottom of the deck like what people are talking about what people think a lot of people listen a lot of people are still talking about your homeless stage of life and you've been past that. You've been got yourself a little little place. Sex and Nate probably called you back. Or you're living with family now or a friend. Like, you're not homeless anymore. And people cannot get over that stage. People cannot get over the fact that you was in a homeless shelter. or They still talk about that. Meantime, between time, they don't want to talk about how you, how you got yourself out of that. 
Okay, they don't want to talk about how you got a 20 or more paying job. $20 or more paying job. Like, they don't want to talk about how, baby, how you got a little side business starting up um, on some entrepreneurship. Like, they don't want to talk about that. Gossip. Ignore the hater. Okay. You have to learn to ignore. That ain't good for nobody. Talk to me, dear guys. What do you have for me? No, 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 don't fall, don't fall. Growth. That's the growth card. Not the growth sisters, the growth card. Not the growth sisters, the growth card. Okay, we're not slimy. We don't have to talk about that back, okay? We're growing. We're healing and growing. We're ignoring the gossip, okay? And we work, work, work because we know what the, we're looking for. At the end of the day, we don't have no... What is it? Um, I'm not even going to say because I don't want to fuck it up. But <sighs> at the end of the day, just know where we are at. We growing and healing over here, baby. Homeless. Talking about who? Not I, not no more. And you know what? There's nothing wrong with it. Sometimes, sometimes it's just life, man. It ain't even your fault. I'm gonna be real. Like, yeah, some people do it to themselves, but at the same time, sometimes this is life. That's just how the cookie crumbles. You gotta get the lesson out of it, okay? It, it humbles you for the rest of your motherfucking life, cause you know, at the end of the day, you can always be back in that place, okay? And that being said, good job, mama. It's beautiful. Good job. Um, I got the renewal cards. So, yeah, she's meditating, babe. She ain't worried about nobody. She's in her own head. She's in her own lane. She's focused. Continue connecting with your higher self. Whoa. Soulmate and release came out at the same damn time. So, for some of you, whoever you thought was your soulmate, ain't really a soulmate and it's time to release them maybe that's because you're moving on up and you know what they say you can't take everybody with you you cannot take everybody with you not everybody is meant um to come to come up with you period okay what the he do for you that he deserves to um sit there and eat the cake with you too he didn't he didn't even offer to go to the store with you or go to the store to get it he didn't even offer to cut the damn cake. He didn't even offer to put no damn candles on it. Oh, you did everything. You eat that cake by yourself, baby. You eat that cake by yourself. Thank you, spirit guides. Self-worth. Yes, yeah, tapping into that self-worth so that you can actually get the courage to release this so-called soulmate. <clears throat> confusion yeah you guys are confused some of you are confused because you literally don't want to cut it off like you literally don't want to cut it off with this person so you're just at a confused state because you know the love is there but at the end of the day at the end of the day baby you gotta make a head over heart decision that's always tough let me be the one to tell you that's always tough a head over heart decision Excuse my boyfriend in the back once again. Talk to him. Talk to me, spirit guys. Too many cards, spirit guys. Let me get one or two at the most. For my Scorpios or any cross watchers. You can be dealing with an Aquarius. Maybe it's that Aquarius you have to maybe it's that Aquarius you have to cut off. Or you have Aquarius in your chart. Talk to me, spirit guides. I mean, maybe you're an Aquarius watching this video for my cross watchers. Talk to me, spirit guides. What do you have for murder? Maybe someone is dealing with um a loss and they could have been an Aquarius. Like, what's going on, spirit guides? Or yeah, like what's going on? Why? why? Marriage, murder, and marriage came out. Make it make sense for me. Ugh. I'm 
getting that. You don't know whether you want to kill or marry the motherfucker. Like, it's so up and down. When I tell you, it's so up and down. Like, literally, some days you be feeling like, mm mm. Mm mm, baby. It might be time for you to go. Or I'm going to do it my damn self. <laughs> I'm going to get you got. I'm going to get you gone, baby. And then sometimes you just sit there, like, just all mesmerized, like, I really can imagine myself marrying you. Well, damn. And we got focus on your mental health for the time being. Oh, all right, like, focus. You don't. You're you're confused. You don't know. You don't know what to do. Focus on that mental health. That'll that'll give you some um, clarity on the situation. So we're gonna end it with that. What did that card say? Stop starving yourself. I thought that said stop sharing yourself. It definitely, like when I, mm -mm. I'm gonna say some of you need to stop passing yourself around. Some of y'all are single, and I said that at 11, 11. Mm. That's for somebody. Some of y'all just been giving it up like it ain't nobody's. Okay, it's yours. Act like you know it. Respect yourself because you're literally sharing yourself.